up guys, how are you doing? Welcome to another day and another vlog and what better way to start this one than our first snowfall of the winter. I don't know how well it comes through on camera but you know what, it's, it's actually coming down quite decently for where we live and where we are considering how much we usually don't get. These four have all been playing it, cats, <laughs> well I say that these four, Jesse's, Jesse's scared, Maggie's back out in it now so I know Steve will love seeing that. Bunny's covered his back in it. I should say that the bunnies have all been out in it. Ooh. The bunnies have both been out playing in it. Sorry, Steve, I slept through that, so I don't have any video footage of that one for you. My bad. <laughs> this is the first time I've seen snow in years, because I mean, like, I don't think we got any up in Southampton. So, like, to have it come down, this is the most I've seen in years as well, like. Ah, uh, yeah, so after that intro yesterday, didn't actually get to film anything else. I had a plan, I, had, I knew what I wanted to do yesterday, but that little tiny bit of snow we had threw a spanner in the works for everything. Anyway, as for the plan, I'm not sure if I've mentioned, but I'm making a Valentine's video. Yeah, you mentioned it, mate. No one cares. We've heard it 15,000 times. All right, mate, chill out. What the f is problem? Anyway, like I said, making this video, so I need to come into town today, pick up some props, because it's for Valentine's, it's all lovey-dovey, all that sort of stuff. I don't own any of that stuff, so I'm meeting Mum and Joe here today, and hopefully they're gonna help me, give me advice on what I should get, what I shouldn't get, and what'll look funny, and what'll suit the video, and whatnot. So let's go find them. 12 seconds later. Okay, so I've only been in town for about 10 minutes or so at the moment, and I've already gone and bought something I didn't really anticipate. I think it just kind of goes better with what I'm wearing today with the colour scheme I've gone for, you know. I like to match all my shit up, be nice and coordinated. And also, I don't have any caps in this colour. Yeah, I still like the one I was wearing beforehand, but I feel like for this whole ensemble, if you will, this one looks a little bit better. Still haven't found Mum and Joe yet. They just texted me. They are on their way to me now. So, uh, I guess I'll go meet them. I found them. They're way off in the distance. Hello. Guys, hi. Hi. Hi, Joe. Hi. Finally found them. Let's see if they can guess what I spent my money on already and the judgment I get from it. How we doing guys? So hey, um, <laughs> already been in town a little bit, already spent some money, that's nothing to do with the script. Been for like 10 minutes. And I say that on here. Now, <laughs> I'll give you a I spent some money, it's nothing to do with the script. Uh, I'm wearing it. Can you guess huh. what it is? Huh. No. <laughs> well, well, yeah, it looks uh, new. Straight away, f***ing. Well, yeah. Where'd you get that? I know what hats you have, girl. So how much? About 25 quid for a hat? That's the end by the way, still. So. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, because I came in, well, because I came in wearing a grey one that kind of goes with these, but it's got bright red on it, and I was like, well, works. I said I like to match it all, let's be coordinated. Such a girl. I'm not a girl, what, what are you doing? Nothing. You might want to take that sticker off. No, it's on the other one as well. She's saying that sticker there needs to come off. Yeah. I don't know. I, I do that sometimes. Some of them I take them off. People go, no, you're supposed to keep them on, dickhead. No, I keep them on. Yeah, why have you taken off, dickhead? <laughs> How do I win this game? Uh, take it off. <laughs> leave take a, it off. Take it off. Let's let everyone stay. Leave a comment. Do I take this <laughs> sticker off or do I leave it on there? Because I really don't <laughs> know. So we were just discussing the shower gels and which oh, ones to yeah, buy oh. and whatnot. You know, real exciting <laughs> And apparently when doing that, how they make my balls feel is not an appropriate way to decide whether or not to get them. Joe, Mum, thoughts, comments, concerns? Come here, no, I'm it wasn't that as far you were talking about in the middle of a shop and you're doing it again. I'm just saying, if I'm using the shower gel and it's making me feel like I've been fondled, I don't want to use it because it feels weird, I don't like it. Ugh, that, get off. That would be reason, but in the middle of a shop, grant. We don't talk about that. I don't want to no. be fondled. Mum's <laughs> embarrassed. Basket full of general shopping and the props for my video. So you can barely even see. You can see what the props. Yeah. I don't want to. I don't want to know what the props are, Joe. Because I don't want to give away the premise of the video. All right. All you need to know is it's Valentine's Day. Three days later. And we are back home now. As the time card says, it is a few days later. I've not really filmed anything the past couple of days because nothing really exciting has happened. But today, though, today I woke up to an email offering me another job interview, which I'm really fun happy about like I said before these four walls get a little bit boring I'm just I kind of want to get back out I kind of want to start earning money again so I'm really looking forward to going to this interview and unlike the last interview I did I am gonna do my research for this one because not doing it didn't really help me I mean it didn't really affect me in a majorly negative way but it also didn't really do me any favors so this morning mom gave me this little book this brochure whatever you want to call it it's the Hendra Holiday Park 
that is the place that has offered me the interview. And I guess it's only right I go and try and have an interview and try and work there because mom's work there, dad's work there, Joe's work there, Steph's work there. The only ones who haven't yet in my family are me and Steve. So I guess maybe it's my turn to try my hand at Hendra. I also just quickly want to remind you guys to leave a comment telling me what you think I should do about my new hat and this sticker on it. Do I take it off? Do I leave it on? Like I said, I've heard arguments from both sides. Take it off, leave it on. Like, does leave it on make it seem real? Does take it off make it look fake? I don't know. Leave a comment telling me what you think I should do because, as I said, I really don't know. And just let me know the reason of why you think I should take it on or leave it off. And if you enjoyed today's video, go ahead and hit that like button because it just shows me that you like the content and you want to see more of it. Speaking of that though and seeing more, hit the subscribe button too so then you can be notified as and when I post these videos and you won't miss any because they are comedy f***ing gold. And I'm going to be back in a few days with another one. So until then, just remember you are the most important person in your life. So live it with no regrets. Peace out. See you again.